Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I authored Toxic Health. Now we're here today to look into the home electrical grounding system in the USA. And we're at my house and right now we have our multimeter is connected up to a ground probe that I've inserted in my back garden which is non-electrified and we have this probe is connected into the power strip grounding which is the home grounding and we're actually reading the voltage that exists between them and we're on AC volts we're on 2 volt setting and we're actually reading 0.455 volts right now so we're almost half a volt AC showing up on the meter but that's not the full story the, the full story is actually shown on the oscilloscope which will now connect into the system so I'm going to ground the oscilloscope probe to the garden and the probe is going to attach onto the AC grounding system through the electrical strip and as we can see we've got this waveform now we're set on 500 millivolts per division in the vertical direction and we actually are covering five squares so that gives us two and a half volts of AC waveform at 60 Hertz coming through on the oscilloscope so uh, it's, it's very very interesting that that's there and I've reported this to the power company and they, they tell me to ignore it which I think is not the right answer so that's why I'm actually exploring this further so the interesting thing is is we have this waveform between two ground rods that are inserted in my garden and uh, if we run what's known as a fast Fourier transform on it it's very interesting what we see so we see all these spikes over here on the left hand side and they're actually called harmonics and the characteristic of the modern AC electrical system in the sense that all elect electronic generation and loads generate harmonics so there's a large amount of harmonic waveforms on this AC grounding system and you've got to be careful about harmonics because they can start generating radio frequencies on the grid and it's particularly concerning that we're actually reading the grounding system of the house right now and what ground rods do is they actually electrify the ground around the area of the ground rods and that can extend into your house and as you find in my house you find that the tile flooring that is near to the ground rods is actually electrified with AC voltage so it's something you've got to be very careful of and I since I became aware of this I now wear my shoes in the house to insulate me from the floor and I avoid coming into contact with the floor because it does have this AC voltage on it so uh, I'm going to expand out the display to 100 Hertz per division and you can see that this is the 60 Hertz spike right here so that's the AC system then the rest of them are all harmonics and you can see that over a kilohertz uh, it repeats very regularly so uh, it's a classic sign of harmonics so I'm going to expand out the display to 10 kilohertz per division now the interesting thing about this is that 10 kilohertz per division we have a spike so we can see that this spike repeats every 10 kilohertz so something on the system is putting 10 kilohertz harmonics onto the system and we're going to expand that a little bit more and see how extensive these harmonics are so I've just gone to 100 kilohertz per division now we can see that there's something from 500 kilohertz up that is also on the system so let's go and see what's happening down at this end so we're now on 1 megahertz per division in the horizontal direction and we can see that right around 1 megahertz we have the spike in frequencies and that's coming from the grounding system so there's something on the grounding system that 
is actually generating frequencies in the range of zero to almost two megahertz at this house. And uh, it's something to be aware of because, you know, grounding is now being promoted as a health technique. And I was researching this, so I actually used a grounding strap, an electronics grounding strap, and connected in to my grounding system whenever I was using my computer. And I got very sick over a few weeks, and that's how I came to discover that my grounding system had all, all these frequencies on it. So uh, just something to be aware of if you're playing around with uh, grounding techniques for human health. You really need to check out your grounding system before you actually connect into it and make sure that it doesn't look like the grounding system on this house. So uh, there you have it. That's my home grounding system. Uh, as you can see, it's very noisy. It's got AC voltage on it and uh, it's something to uh, stay away from. Certain things like grounded electrical cases will connect you into the grounding system. So you should be very wary of uh, coming into contact with any metal that is grounded on your home electrical system, if it looks like what this house is. I hope you enjoyed this presentation, and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.